I mentioned one of the com comments uh, that people, re well, I replied to some of the comments until the one I found. This valve is a, the exhaust valve. It had a big burn spot on it uh, somewhere on it. Now you can't tell, but I tried to run that on the drill with uh, on the grinder with my drill, and that'd be fine. Except you know when it's got that little caved-in spot there, and when you do that, it's almost impossible to keep it moving it in and out with the, where the thing is. It had some way of uh, you know keeping it secured. That'd be all right. So anyway, I uh, just a minute, cat get out here quick enough. No, I can't come to visit and scratch on my chair. Anyway, that uh, valve was not any good. So uh, I, just, I thought maybe we'd have to wait a while on it uh, because I didn't know if I could find one. But lo and behold, I did find one on the internet for like 11 bucks. I went ahead and ordered it. And I haven't pulled the other one out to see if it's uh, bad or not. Because like I say, there's no big rush on this thing. So we get to, I might take that one out. He can take out a little sooner or something. but. Anyway, that's the deal on it. We've got to wait now for the valve, then we'll get back at it. So, now, These things are just about like a, well, uh, in essence, the same <laughs> cats up here fooling around. The, uh, just like, about like the uh, overhead valve Briggs do, you know, you loosen up a lock nut and adjust it down. It's not like the old, other old Briggs where you had to, uh, you know, grind the bottom off the valve to get the right set. All right, well, I'm going to get out here. The cat's just completely aggravating the heck out of us here, so. Take care. That's it for now.